ladies, welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I truly appreciate your love and support. Pisces, today we are going to find out who is spying on you and why. And please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it will not apply to each and every one of you. All right, Pisces, let's get your reading started. Speak to me, please show me who is spying on, uh, on Pisces and why. Please show me more. Pisces, I'm trying to conserve my voice because I've been losing my voice, so I'm going to speak softly. However, if you can't hear me, I'd like to suggest that you use the headphone. I have a mic on the whole time anyway, okay? Just in case. All right, so Pisces, this person is definitely very obsessed over you, okay? Obsessively spying on you. This person may be a Capricorn, maybe a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, like you are, a Virgo, Leo. Um, pretty strong five signs, I would say. Very Sagittarius, Leo as well. It can be any sign, all right? <clears throat> so the devil here does indicate them obsessively stalking you or spying on you because they want to see if there's hope between the two of you, okay? And we've got the tower here. This person and you, I feel like may have ended because of something that was unexpected, okay? Or either the ending between you and this person, the ending of your connection between you and this person was very abrupt or something was being revealed, okay? So got the 10 of Wands here in my verse. Is somebody you have let go of. You just don't feel like you want to carry this burden anymore. However, you know, the devil still brings you back into thinking about them a lot with the hermit here. But this could also be them, okay? Um, I sense also at the same time, this person may be reflecting a lot in regards of what had happened in the past between two of you. I sense them spying on you mostly during nighttime, okay, because these are so dark, the devil and the hermit, as well as the sun here in reverse. So they are not very happy in regards to what had happened between two of you. If this was a friend, I feel like both of you may have a fallout. But I feel like for most of you, about 90% of you Pisces, this is somebody whom you were in a love connection with. Only because I'm seeing the Five of Cups here, but could also be a friend, okay? Um, King of Wands is right here. There could be multiple people. I would say maybe two or three people spying on you. Um, definitely the strongest one is that one person where you had a, the biggest fallout with or a separation you were in a love connection with perhaps you still love them queen of cups here because it's actually your energy pisces cancer scorpio and this person i feel like with the king of wands because you've got the masculine and the feminine here so this person may be an aries sagittarius leo or uh, could be a Virgo Capricorn Taurus. I see multiple people here. Again, uh, Pisces. I feel like with the Five of Swords in my verse, this may be somebody whom you've given up on, okay? You just no longer want to deal with their drama and whatnot. I feel like with the Page of Cups here also, this may be um, them wanting to, them spying on you because they think maybe they want to send you a message of either an apology or invite you to something as well. I'm getting, I'm giving you something unexpectedly, okay? But Paige is a messenger. Mostly I feel like it's sending you a message. Um, the chariot is in reverse here. So I feel like this connection between you and this person may have been put, uh, may have been stopped, okay, for whatever reason here. Maybe somebody uh, may have been very, you know, five of swords in reverse. Maybe somebody very underhanded. Um, to me, the Five of Swords can be somebody quite conniving. A little bit similar to the Seven of Swords, but not exactly, okay? Hmm. Let's see more. <laughs> we got the Nine of Swords here in reverse. Could be, this person may also be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. I feel like this person is spying on you because they are still holding on to this connection. Or oh, this is somebody you're gonna tr that you're trying to protect from getting yourself hurt from them. In the past, I feel like maybe this person may have hurt you. I feel like you may still be angry with them or holding some grudges with the Nine of Swords here, Nine of Swords here in reverse. Um, 
The person may have been a liar, may have been a cheater as well, or if it's not a liar, I just sense maybe they could have been very verbally abusive or manipulative in some way, shape or form, okay? Or both of you just couldn't get along. Um, may have arguments as well, that's what I'm getting. The tower sometimes goes to indicate like a big argument and then boom and that's it, we are done, we're over, you know. So we've got the seven of wands here in reverse, we've got the world of fortune in reverse. I feel like this person is definitely somebody who still hasn't moved on yet from you, but I feel like seven of wands in reverse may indicate this you no longer fighting for this connection. King of Pentacles, this can actually be to me a friendly sign here with the King of Pentacles. Virgo, Capron, Taurus can be a business partner, can be a co worker, or a boss because the King of Pentacles can be a boss, okay? Or could be a father figure as well. King of Pentacles is a father figure. And there's a younger energy here I'm sensing Page of Cups in, uh, in an upright position. This is only for some of you, okay, Pisces. If you have a teenage child, your child is constantly spying on you. It's a friendly spying, okay? It's checking up on your social media and whatnot. Only if you have a teenage child, that's what I'm getting. Um, could be 13, 14 onwards. So we've got the magician here in the first, Virgo, Cap uh, Virgo Gemini energy. Yeah, there was some. there is somebody, Pisces, I feel like you were either in love with Okay, in the past, whom well, you may either you may have made a choice or they may have made a choice, okay, to let go of this connection because somebody may have seen their true colors. Again, even before the magician came out, I I could sense this person could be manipulative or that they could be hiding something, okay. So we got the eight pentacles in reverse. Yep, this is the person whom I feel you may have started off a relationship with and look very solid or connection that just didn't take off and both of you are in disharmony right now with the temperance here in reverse. But this person is definitely very obsessed over you. I feel like it's it's like stalking, <laughs> more more stalking than just spying. I feel like they're definitely going through a lot right now. They could be a little bit depressed, very, very unhappy, I would say, with the sun here in reverse as well. Hmm. This is also some of you still haven't find, you still find it really hard to forgive, okay? Yep. All right, Pisces, this is your reading. I hope you resonated. Oh, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm going to leave you with one video on the screen right now. This is a video from my second vlog channel. If you guys are interested to check it out, this is an update of where I'm at right now. Um, and showing you my beautiful country. If you guys are interested, check it out. If nothing else, Pisces, hope to see you back here uh, soon.